Well, a baby Jesus figurine was away in a manger until he was stolen away from his manger. But in a weird twist, the statue has been returned and it seems like it had a little help from above. MTN's John Amy has more. When Andrea and Jack McCormick returned to their Butte home on New Year's Day after being gone a few days, they noticed the most important figure in their nativity was gone. It was just sort of the thing you always feared had finally happened. The figurine of the baby Jesus was part of a historic nativity scene that was first displayed at the St. Helena Church in the long lost Butte neighborhood of Meterville more than 60 years ago. Oh, I was just crushed because I knew my uncle who had originally owned the set was always cautious about putting it out because they were always afraid that the figures might be taken. Andrea McCormick, who is 66, remembers seeing this nativity when she was a little girl at the St. Helena Church in Meterville, before the church and the neighborhood were removed to make room for open pit mining in the 60s. And the priest would carry the baby into the church and place him in the crib at midnight mass. After making pleas on social and local media for the return of the baby, on Thursday morning, Jack McCormick went out to his mailbox and found a surprise laying in the snow. He came in with a big grin on his face saying, guess what I found? The baby was left with two posted notes attached with a message from someone claiming to be God. And they said God had taken his son on a trip, and now he was returning him. Now the McCormicks say they have no hard feelings for whoever it was that took the baby Jesus. They're just happy that whoever did it decided to do the right thing and bring him back where he belongs. Whoever took it, whatever their reasons, I'm so glad they chose to return it. The figurine represents a neighborhood that has long since disappeared. There's still a lot of people out there with Meterville Memories, it was a fabulous neighborhood and a, and, and a very devoted church congregation. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News. And John tells us the couple plans to continue displaying the nativity scene during the holidays, but they plan to keep a closer eye on it.